Uh, 55 gallon update here. Um, I think the fish are all pretty much the same. I got a uh, powder blue tang there. Got something new. Got some food in there. Some new food I got today. Let's see if they eat it. There's my uh, puffer fish, powder blue tang. Elephant tang, uh, three stripe damsel, uh, blue damsel, bicolor angel, and that, that's new actually. Uh, flame angel back there, uh, blue hippo tang, my favorite fish. Six line wrasse went back there somewhere. the coral beauty and as for the um, started doing went to a frag show highly recommend that a lot of fun got some uh, frags some SBS uh, acropora and stuff in there got two frag shelves same old two mushroom rocks uh, manipora back there that for cheap, five bucks. Normally five bucks you like a quarter size. Got a told stool leather, another told stool leather that uh actually has an open up, it looks way sweeter in the store. Um Green Star Pile up, Duncan that needs to boom up a little bit. Uh Colostria, a plate coral's new, another big mushroom, some um frog spawn, big only 15 bucks. I got that big uh, uh, acropora back there. It was in the $15 uh, rack. I was like, that's a mistake. Guys, like, no. I'm like, I'll take it. Why is it 15 bucks? It's, like, it's brown. No one wants brown. I was like, whatever for the size of that. Like that millipora, that's new. I paid 75 for that, and that's bigger. Some more green star polyp. Uh, pink fabia. Leather coral. Leather coral. This is new. I got a uh, uh, green wellsy, some uh, coral lake and elk near mushroom, uh, nice torch coral. Got a uh, galaxia back there, and then I'm hiding uh, some zoanthids up there. And uh, that's about it. Uh, I got here with some of these fish. You got too many fish in there. Um, Saw a sweet baby uh, queen angel I wanted to get. I picked up a uh, juvenile baby Koran angel. I uh, put him in another tank just so it's less fish in there, less stressful. I don't want to put him here and have him terrorized by uh, everybody. Some angels. I like that. Walsy's cool. I had these guys selling at the frag. It was like 150 300 bucks. These uh, Aussie, Scony, Stoey, whatever, donut corals, corals, psychedelic colors. They look sweet, but um, $300 is a lot of money. I <laughs> want someone who has a die on me. Uh, this is similar, easy to keep, I guess. So this one lives. I'll uh, get one of those psychedelic ones. Uh, I was at the fish store today. I, I got this at a big um, warehouse uh, dealer that's now open to public. It wasn't before. I paid 30 bucks for that thing. Um, probably doesn't come out good in the camcorder. But I uh, went to the fish store afterwards and they wanted uh, 75 bucks for those and they were much, much uglier. So. Uh, I'm looking at the other tank next to it. Here's actually. Uh, baby Coran. This tank is a mess. I apologize. I gotta I tore it apart. I gotta re it. But hopefully he comes out. He looks really sweet. So as long as this guy uh, my, I got a bunch of dwarf angels but as long as he lives this uh, <clears throat> big angel uh, there he is. I'll go ahead and get that queen. He was 35 because the uh, baby queen angel was uh, well, they wanted like a hundred bucks for them. I've never seen them before. Uh, like two, three hundred bucks for a big one. They had a huge one in there. It was actually really sweet. I just ran into a friend of mine from 17 years ago in uh, elementary school. Didn't even recognize him. 
I recognized me and asked me if I went to school with them, and I was like, oh yeah, yeah. So anyway, small world, um, so he showed me this, they had these big pools in the back where they um, propagate their corals, and this huge queen angel in there, and he, it's like a pool, he put his uh, hand in the water, swished it around, the thing went from one end of the pool all the way up to him, just like a dog, and uh, told me a couple guys offered uh, the owner uh, over a couple grand for this one uh, queen angel, which normally go for like two, three hundred bucks, so... I don't know, some kind of showfish, I guess, perfect condition. Which I think of my blue hippo is in per perfect condition. Every time I see a big one of those, they're all beat to hell. Uh, fins are all ripped up, all scarred and everything. So, anyways, I also put in a, uh, a new light fixture. I'll show you that. It's a LED strip light. Well, that's really cool. Brings out, pops out the colors there at night. I can, uh, I got a uh, other tank has uh, moonlights and um, I got a new uh, bio cube has them. So one in here, it's the biggest tank. So doesn't look like it's coming out good in the camera here, but uh, it's really sweet. I can watch the fish at night, which ones aren't sleeping, but. Show you what that looks like. So I just retrofitted that this big uh, four foot uh, LED wand in there. So that, those are pretty sweet. Uh, online they were ten bucks a, a head. I got like seven or eight heads there. I got that frag for ten bucks. These uh whatever, nuclear green, things that they call them. It's a hammer coral. I'm trying to put up close there to uh, get the thing to grow out. I accidentally was cleaning and I left out a sweet tree. It's basically a tree. It was, uh, I don't know, I'm trying one of my videos, maybe the first one. It had 18 heads, I think, and the, the bottom, there wasn't any heads, so it looked like a tree, it had a stem. And it left it out, and it all shriveled up and died, but two heads, and those two heads are now four or six heads. And I was talking to the guy at the store. I got that thing for cheap, 60, or 35 bucks, I think. He said they charge uh, 20 bucks a head. He showed them to me, and they weren't anywhere near, you know, neon green like that. So if they had this coral before I killed most of it off, I'm looking at a, what they would probably charge as a $600 coral, believe it or not. But, yeah, it looks pretty dull looking into the uh, uh, screen of the camcorder. I got some uh, recordian stuff that I buy that I put on this uh, kind of tree stick here. Some zoomanthids there. But, it's my marine land, so you can hit the button, you get two actinics. Hit it again, the two whites. Then both come on. So... Anyways, that's my third update on the 55 gallon tank I have. Too many fish in here. I gotta upgrade to a 75 or a 90. I don't have any more room. I really want a 6 foot tank. As they call them, tang police on the forums. They always say you gotta have a 6 foot tank for tanks. At least one 12 miles a day or whatever. But I'll get that eventually. For now, I'm gonna have to go from the 55 to either a 75 or a 90. 75 would be a huge improvement. I just bought this. It was the biggest kit they had at Walmart. I wish I had a 75. It's same aquarium, just six inches uh, wider, so I get six more inches of sand where I can put more rocks and put more stuff in there, and obviously the fish should be happier, but, uh, uh, the torch is really cool, but, yeah, that's about it for this video, post it up on YouTube, so anyone that's watched my other two can watch this one and see the changes and stuff that's been going on. Alright, until next time, I'll, uh, I got a 10 gallon nano on my computer. I gotta start putting some, uh, sweet rock work there. There's a couple, three fit little fish. I gotta take a video of that, put some corals in there, post that. Alright, so until next time, see you guys.